What's up guys, Matthew HD here and welcome back to Atletico Madrid Career Mode. Today it is episode 12. As we can see in the Global Transfer Network, I've added Lukaku and Christian Manteke. Um, so yeah, I need you to really get on down below and tell me who I should be trying to bring in in January because it's going ever closer with November creeping up on us now. So uh, yeah, we're going to do this press conference eventually. I'm going to wait until the 22nd of the 23rd to do it and uh, I'll stop. There's a bit of a break there and we've got two games and then Juventus. So it's going to be a very tricky match and we do need to win this game to keep our, you know, our good run of form going. Let me know about Sweden as well. So what am I going to do? Player uh, Diego Costa, give him a boost, praise him, you know, just keep up the good morale there with him because, you know, he is a, he's an absolutely class player to be able to have on our bench so um yeah uh sweden <laughs> all right so uh we're gonna go and we're gonna play this match um yeah hopefully we can win it hopefully we can win it i'm gonna consider making substitutions at around the 50th minute just to give you know the key players a good rest so uh yeah um let's get into it and i'll show you the highlights all right so guys here we go up against Getafe at home a uh, pretty important match. It's not obviously crucial, but it'll be important to get the win here. Hopefully, we can do it in front of the crowd. They're all out in force. So, yeah, hopefully, we can do this. Actually, the goals. Insigne. Oh, what a thumping goal there in the 22nd minute. Lorenzo, take a bow, son. An absolutely smashing goal. Belted that one into the top corner there. Keeper was never going to say that. And let's check out the replay. Absolutely smashed that one. Bang, back of the net. That is a booyah, son. John Fran gets the ball, wins it well. Lorenzo breaks free here. Lorenzo with another smashing goal there. Absolutely brilliant shot there. 40 second minute, 20 minutes in between. And another goal for Lorenzo. Told you Insigne was good. This guy's going to be important to buy, I think. I mean, look at him. Uh, absolutely brilliant goal there. Battling against the defender there and back the net goalkeeper. Never going to get down that low. Brilliant goal, 2 0. Absolutely delighted. Anyway, 2-0, um, two very good goals from Lorenzo and Um I'd like to think that the game is more or less settled. Um, we'll have to see Espanyol drawing. That could be very handy for us. Um, around the 50th minute, maybe 55th minute, I'll start to take off people like Costa, Ramirez and Sandro, I would say. Give them a rest and Signe will be alright. Leo could even take his place, but yeah. So we're going to get back into the game now. Too easy for Lorenzo. Patrick already cannot believe that one. Cannot believe that one. That goalkeeper is shocking, honestly. That that is absolutely terrible to watch it like. An easy pass in here, defenders were well, closing, but I mean torn spin back the net goalkeeper too slow. Trina and Hatrick for Lorenzo and Signe. Delighted. Game Oh Indoy Indoy Boom Back of the net. Four nil. Easy second minute goal for Indoy there. A, a smashing goal. Lonzo split him. I mean, the pace here. Getafe's defence is absolutely woeful when it comes to pace. I mean, look at that. They couldn't keep up. Takes a heavy touch there, but bang, back the net. Never going to miss that one in all seriousness. So, yeah, 4 0, absolutely delighted. Good win today. Good win. Um, 4 0 at full time. Uh, great display. Uh, Lorenzo really proving his worth there. I told you this guy was good. And, um, yeah, he got man of the match, of course. I mean, a hat trick. Um, and Doi, 7.3 relatively happy. Turan, when he came on, he wasn't going to make much of an impact. Gabby picked up yellow card. Uh, Adrian Coke, alright, uh, good performance from Godin. Louise could have done better and Diego Costa wasn't involved too much. So a managerial perspective, it was quite a pleasing game. So yeah, I'll uh, show you what comes up next. Okay, so um, player conversations. Diego Godin, hey boss, I value my role at the club. I'll be trying to my best out there all the time. So thanks for playing. Yeah, good man, Diego. I mean, he he sound out like he's 27. Uh, he's 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 in the prime of his career, really. So now a must win game up against Juventus. Um, basically, if we win, we'll go on 11 points, and um, we'll have two more games to play. Then I think no one more game to play. So yeah, absolutely shitting a brick over this one. Pardon the language there, but I mean, it's a must win game against Juventus. And, and the game that comes after that, I'm willing to, to field, you know, my reserves basically for that one. I mean, who cares about it? I mean, France, second. I don't know. I, I want to win the league, but I mean, I have to focus on the more important things. So you can see that they're all looking pretty much fit. My, my tactic worked out perfectly. One of the biggest games of the season. 
Uh, so yeah, it's gonna be very very good. So hopefully we can we can win this. I'll show you the highlights and uh, yeah, come on, come on, let it go. We can do this. So guys, biggest game of the season so far, I would say. Juventus versus Atletico Madrid. Hopefully we can win this. Come on, let's do this. Away from home. Come on, let's be Juventus in the back garden. Come on, come on. Go on, Ramirez. Ramirez in a good position. Oh my God, what a goal, Lorenzo. What form he is in. He's seventh goal. What? Oh my God. Five minutes in, we've taken the lead in one of the most crucial games. Oh my, what a header from the little legend. Watch this. Bang. Back to the net. Buffon was never going to get to that. Oh, one nil off, lads. Can we continue this? Hopefully we can. To stop it. Piolo picks up the ball, the passing master. The maestro plays in a good ball. And what a goal. Vucinic, that was an amazing goal. And our wobble has just been bossed a little bit there. Piolo, brilliant pass. Poor defending. Bang. I'd still be hopeful. 1-1. One, one. This is going to be a good game. Alright, so guys, half time 1-1. One, one. <laughs> the, the tensest game I've ever played. Absolutely a uh, fantastic game. I mean, look at this for across from Insigne, or from Ramirez to Insigne, back post. Absolutely brilliant goal, brilliant finish. So I'm um, trying to see Celtic nil nil. So that's going in our favour, basically. We really need to get the win here. I'm hopefully we to wins it. Referee, referee, clearly yes. Is that a penalty? I think it very well could be. That should be a red card for Chiellini there. I'm sorry. That's a goal scoring opportunity. That is a clear goal scoring opportunity right there. Is it, I'm not sure where it is on the edge of the box or whatever it is, which it is, edge of the box. Um, I'm not very confident here. So I'm going to go, cook. Oh no. 1-1, one, one. absolutely, ve I'm very disappointed, I'm not going to lie. We started off so well, but we just couldn't do it. We missed some absolutely stunning chances, I mean, <sighs> that, mm, we're still in the same position, so we need Juventus to lose. The reason I'm so worked up about it is, if we came first in our group, we'd get an easier draw, or at least I believe that's how it works, or we could be just running. Something to brighten up our day. David Villa is back from injury. I'm not going to be throwing him into the squad straight away, but um, I'm going to you know, start bringing him into the benches, you know, bring him into the fall a little bit more. He'll definitely make the bench, because, I mean, look at this. I mean, we put it all out on that game now, and um, unfortunately it didn't didn't work out. Uh, obviously, he has to work up his fitness and stuff like that. He had a broken rib, did he? I can't remember. We missed him. We definitely did, but, I mean, look, Insignia came up so well that game. I mean, he scored four goals in two games brilliant like so we can delete that and uh, we're still waiting for Sweden I don't think I should accept it I'm only going to really accept you know the big ones such as Argentina or Brazil so guys um, that had, that's the episode oh I didn't notice we are 30 we're five points clear uh, Barcelona still have two games to play though so that's a little bit of an iffy one um, oh, press the wrong button now anyway uh, the video is coming to an end go now guys if you did enjoy the video please drop a like follow me on twitter to get a chance to play things such as pink slips etc etc and um yeah guys it's been absolutely great and uh yeah i'll see you next time bye bye this is the rhythm of the night.